In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the 3D Viewer plugin for WordPress by B Plugins. To get started, here is my WordPress dashboard, and I want to begin by installing the plugin. So I'm going to go down to my plugins. I'm going to click Add New Plugin, search for 3D Viewer. This is the plugin I'm looking for. You can see the author is B Plugins. I'll click Install Now, and then activate it. With the plugin set up, I want to add my first 3D model. So under the 3D viewer options, I'm going to click add new. We'll give our model a name. Let's just call it demo. And then down under the settings, we want to find the option to upload our 3D model. So I'm going to click upload source. I'm going to select a file on my computer to upload. I've got an example 3D model we can work with. With that uploaded, I'll click select. And then you should see the path to that 3D model listed here. Now scroll through the other settings, there's all sorts of customizations you can make to this model, uh, influencing how it's going to display from the width, the height, background color, that sort of thing. You can see all the options that are available. Uh, but we just want to see this in action, so I'm going to save my work. And then I want to copy this short code. This is what I'm going to use to embed this model throughout my application. Uh, for example, let's create a new page within our site. So I'm going to say add new page. I'm going to give this page a title, once again we'll just call it demo. And then to embed my 3D model, I'm going to click the plus icon, and I want to search for shortcode. Choose the shortcode option, and then paste in the shortcode for the model that we just uploaded. Then following that, of course, you can add any other content you would typically add to a page. For example, I'll just add some text afterwards. All right, when we're done, we can click publish. We'll click publish again. And then let's see it in action. I'm going to click view page. And there we go, there's our 3D model. And as you can see, it's completely interactive. All right, now let's do that same process again, but this time let's create a new post. So we're gonna say add new post, add a title. Once again, we're gonna search for the option to add a shortcode. We'll paste in the shortcode for the same model. And then just like in our page, we can add additional content if we needed, uh, or we could just go straight to publish. And then let's make sure that looks as expected. Perfect, so there's our 3D model example in a post. Finally, let's look at one more example. Uh, let's say we wanna add this to a product page via our WooCommerce plugin. We can go to products and say add new. We'll give the product a name. And then I'm gonna scroll down to the section for 3D viewer settings, and I'm gonna click add new model. I'm gonna click upload. Uh, but we're not actually going to upload a new file in this case. You could at this point, but uh, what I'm going to do is go over to my media library and select that existing 3D model I had already uploaded. And then we'll attach that by clicking select. And then you can see there's a couple options you can play around with in terms of how this is going to display uh, on the product page. Uh, but let's uh, see what this looks like. So I'm going to go back to the top and click publish. And then I'm going to open up my product page. And there you go. There's our 3D model on our product page. So as you can see, it's very easy to embed 3D objects in any of your content on your WordPress sites using the 3D Viewer by B Plugins.